Hi friends, in this session, I am going to explain about top level concepts in Azure Data Factory. This is one of important concept in the Azure Data Factory. If you understand these concepts, you can easily follow the other concepts. So, if anybody watching first time my video, please subscribe my channel and also like my channel and also share with your friends. Why? Because in this channel, I am providing complete training of Azure Data Factory from beginning level to advanced level and also interview questions, real-time project explanation with scenario based, monthly updates, much more updated in this channel. So if you follow my classes from class one, you will definitely will get the job and also easily survive in the real-time environment. So in this class, we are going to discuss about what are the top level concepts in Azure Data Factory and also we are going to compare with SSIS. If anybody knows SSIS, it will be very easy. If you don't know SSIS, if you want to learn SSIS, we have SSIS videos also. Okay. What you have to do is you have to go to YouTube. In the YouTube, you can search like uh, Power BI real time or else you can search with my name. Okay. Jabula Vanali. Anything that would be fine. Okay. Power BI real time. You can find my YouTube channel Power BI real time. Okay. So and you can click here. You can able to see the all the videos see here all the playlist we have right so you can able to see azure data factory and ssis ssas and power bi playlist okay you can go to the ssis and you can learn ssis concepts as well okay coming to our topic what we are going to do is if anybody knows ssis so how we can differentiate azure data factory see we can also by using Azure Data Factory, we can lift and shift uh, SSIS packages into the Azure Data Factory. Okay, fine. Top level concepts in Azure Data Factory. The top level, first of all, Azure Data Factory in the Azure, first of all, we have to create a account. If anybody watching first time my video, please check class one video. In the class one, how to create the Azure account, free subscription already explain okay and uh, after that the first we have to create a azure data factory after that we have to create a pipeline then linked service then source then sync then activity then data flow okay so in azure data factory first of all we are going to create a azure data factory instance but in ssis tool so it first of all we are going to create a project so inside the project, we can able to create multiple packages. In the same way, in Azure Data Factory, first of all, you are going to create an Azure Data Factory instance. Inside that, we are going to create multiple pipelines. So here project, in SSIS, there is a project and in Azure Data Factory, it is a Azure Data Factory, okay? In SSIS, package is equal to pipeline in the Azure Data Factory. In the same way, in SSIS, we called connection manager. Connection manager to connect to the source, we are going to use this connection manager. Here in ADF, we called is it is linked service. The name is different, that's it. Okay. And in ADF, it is a source, right? In the SSIS, also we call it is a source. For source, we can call it as source. There is no much difference it is very important if you understand this and if you keep in mind you can easily understand this adf okay who knows ssis okay fine in ssis packages we call it as destination but in adf we call it as sync 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 okay and uh, control flow task control flow task what is the importance of control flow task so control flow task is going to responsible which task is going to execute first, second, third, fourth like that. Okay. If you want detail explanation, you can go to my playlist and you can check in the previous videos as well. Okay. Here control flow task in the SSIS, but in ADF it is a activity. Okay. So in SSIS, there is a data flow. Okay. Here in ADF also data flow. These are the top level concepts we can say okay pipeline linked in service uh, linked service and uh, source sync 
activity and data block this is a interview question as well as okay if anybody watching first time please uh, subscribe okay thank you for watching my video if anybody wants uh, special training also you can contact to my email id or else you can directly call to my mobile number or else you can to the whatsapp also okay thank you for watching my video once again